Oh, hello, Martin. Come on in. Peter! Henry! Martin's here! You're going out again? Oh, don't be horrid, Henry. You know we've got Peter's teacher talk tonight. Oh, I can't wait for you to hear about all the good as gold stars I've got. Neither can I, honey bun. Your dad and I are very proud of you. Yeah, because it's really hard to be good as gold all the time. Actually, it is, Henry. Much harder than you think. Harder than being horrid all the time, I should think. I'm not horrid all the time, am I? Anyway, what's for tea? Peter's cooking. Because we can always get a takeaway, you know, save your cooking. What did you say? I said Peter's cooking. Peter's cooking? Cooking what? Bye, boys. House hot pot. No! Why, thank you, kind sir. A pleasure, milady. Oh, you. <laughs> To you. Oh, hello. Good evening to you, too. Let's do this. With pleasure, my lady. Greetings, both. Oh, greetings to you, too. Oh, dear. I'm getting flashbacks. It's OK. Just remember, tonight we're Peter's parents, not Henry's. Yes, of course. Shall we? Welcome, welcome to our happy place where happy children learn happy things. Now, if I could just ask you to collect your timetables from this lovely over there, and then we can get started. The trick to a really good house hot pot is to give it all a really good star. The trick to a really good house hot pot is not to make it in the first place. And when you've done that, you can add a little bit of magic water to make it really light and fluffy. What's magic water when it's at home? It's water that has magic in it. So it's just water then? No. It's water that has magic in it. Oh, why don't Mum and Dad ever have anything to eat in the fridge? It's so easy being me. I'm Incredible! Weird, more like. What do you mean, weird? Yeah, weird. Never you mind, bogey brain. You're weird. That's what, Snot Slime. Yeah, Snot Slime. Hey, time out! We're only talking about a TV show. Yeah, a TV show. A TV show that is the best TV show in the whole wide world. No, it's not. Too Cool for School is the best TV show in the whole wide world. Isn't, 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 isn't. Henry, but may I ask that you sit down and know? Now then, may I ask what exactly it was you were arguing about? Henry said the Boodle Poodles were weird. I happen to think that Boodle Poodles is one of the best TV shows in the whole wide world. So that's a double detention for you, Henry. And it's not even nine o'clock yet. <laughs> you are doing well. No! What's her name? Yeah, what's her name? Uh, Princess Poppy Pants, I think. Yeah, that's it. So, last week, Princess Poppy Pants beat the Platinum Boodle Poodle. Oh, what was her name? Princess Poopy Pants. Who asked you, slug features? So, last week, Princess Poppy Pants beat what's her name at slipper throwing. Yeah, slipper throwing. And this week, they're going to be hula hoopy. 
yeah, hula hooping. <laughs> Fan could do all those things. Yeah, he could beat the boodle poodles hands down. <laughs> you talking about that smelly old demented rat that bites everything inside? He's not a rat. He's a hamster. Man, he only bites evil people. Well, I'd like to see him do all the things that boodle poodles do. But he can do them all and more. Even synchronised swimming. Even synchronised swimming. You're on. You what? My garden. Tomorrow morning, the contest begins. What do we do now? I guess we go and tell Fang what you've got him into. It's so easy being me. I'm I want you to add these numbers, then multiply the answer by this number, then divide it by this number, then speak the lady the Down, everyone. Maths never hurt anyone. Yeah, yuck. We will be Hey, alien, over here. Yuck, yuck. We will. <laughs> you saved us. Well, someone had to get rid of the maths monster. Henry. Henry? Henry! Are you listening to me? Now, which of you deserves a brave badge? Uh, me, miss! I saved us from the maths monster! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. As I was saying, we'll find out tomorrow who is brave and who is not. Because tomorrow is... Injection Day! Injection day? No! It's only an injection. It's not like it's major surgery. Silence, worm. Don't be nervous, Henry. Ha! Nervous? Why would I be nervous? It's only an injection. That's right. It's just a few centimetres of needle jabbed into your flesh. Ah! And the winner of the gold medal for javelin is... Henry! Oh, wait. It appears we have one more contestant. Ah! Ah! And then oh. they pull the needle out and... You awake? Uh, yes, Miss Battleaxe. Uh, I mean, no, Miss Battleaxe. Pay attention then. Oh, uh, sorry, Miss Battleaxe. Late night last night. I'm sure. <laughs> now, as I was saying, it's that time of year when we say goodbye to our old class rep. Goodbye. Good riddance. And we say hello to our new class rep. Oh, please, Miss. Pick me, Miss. Now then, Nicola, as old class rep... Goodbye. Yes, thank you, Nicola. As old class rep, would you remind us of our class motto? Bogius Maximus. <laughs> <clears throat> Do unto others as you would be done by. Thank you, Nicola. That means you'd all better behave or else. Uh, no, it doesn't. It means... Yes, thank you, Brian. So, Nicola, it's time for a new class rep. Goodbye. And a new class motto. Who are you going to choose, Nicola? Oh, please, Miss Mimis. Ah, yes, Margaret. Too moody. Not today, thank you, Margaret. <laughs> Too weepy. 
No, thank you, William. <laughs> no, no. And Bert, do you really want to? I don't know. I choose Henry. Nicola, class dismissed. Like a little dog. Yes, thank you, Nick. Talking of dogs, where's Vittle Wagner? <laughs> uh, I think I found him. I didn't mean to land on Vittle Wagner, honest. Oh, I shouldn't worry about that, Henrietta. He'll be right as rain once they've got his paw out of his ear. <laughs> hmm. This lemonade's really nice, Great Old Greta. Time for a rock kick? No, thanks. Not just yet, Great Old Greta. My, my, look at the time. Time flies when you're having fun, eh, Henrietta? <laughs> Shall we go, then? Not so fast, Henrietta. There's something we haven't done yet. What's that? Your skipping lesson. My skipping lesson? <laughs> I give up. That's my girl. Now then, legs lift and sideways jump and up, down and all around. So I said to her, I said, if you think that gives you the right to be some junior lieutenant commander, then you've got another thing. Oh, what is that? And spin, Henrietta. Hey, not slide. Try a train through the tunnel. Oh, Henrietta! Choo choo! <laughs> Bet you can't do that, bogey brain! Wouldn't want to! That is seriously weird! Come on, Grinda! We're leaving! <laughs> Ready for a rock cake now, Henrietta? Hmm. I don't mind if I do, Great Aunt Greta. Uh, what's in it? Flour, butter, sugar, raisins. <laughs> All right. Still think I'm seriously weird, Henrietta? Uh, yes, but I like it that way. What do you have to 
do to be alone around here? Um, spaghetti, condensed milk, baked beans. Oh, Henry, I'm going to the supermarket. Do you want anything? You can't go! Uh, not yet! Why not? Because uh, I want to go with you, but I can't go until... until... until I clean my room. You want to clean your room? <laughs> I can wait for that. Yes! Mum, we've run out of sweet sweets. We need to get more. Henry, stop! I have to get the sweet sweets. All right, but just one box. Market. Not to mention that we had to buy every box in the store. That's no TV for a month. And we'll be reassessing your pocket money downwards. Now go to your room and stay there. Oh, the humiliation. What'll we do with these? We can't let Henry have them. No, we can't. But I know exactly who to give them to. I hope you brought your best. What do you want to give me for this? <laughs> it's so easy being me. I'm Harlan Henry. Where are you? so much about perfume anyway. <sighs> because I'm an inventor, and inventors invent things, like perfume. You That's it! Peter, how do you fancy inventing Mum's anniversary present for both of us? Hmm, what's in it for me? Fame, fortune, making Mum happy. I hate it when you're nice to me, Henry. <laughs> oh, I thought you said you were an inventor! All you've invented so far is a load of explosions! Easy one! Just my little joke. Come on, we can't hang about. I mean, 
most wonderful inventor? Behold my perfume. It smells just like a delicate rose. Hmm, not bad, if you like girly smells. Just uh, how much of this stuff have you made? Quite a lot. It's so easy being me. I'm Mother, look what you've done! What? Um, uh, uh, I mean, oops a daisy, Mumsy, not to worry. Thank you, everyone. At the end of our first round, our top three families are Steve and family, Margaret and family, and Peter and Henry and family. I mean, uh, great. What are we going to do? Don't worry. I know how to fix Henry. Now, everyone, change places, please. to host a family tea party with a very special guest, me. Let the challenge commence. Right, uh, Henry, would you be kind enough to hand around some napkins? Of course I would. It would be a pleasure. Napkin, madam? Why, thank you, young man. Uh, sandwich, ma'am? Thank you, most kind. Mum, thank you, dear. Patience, Margaret, patience. Dad? Thank you, Peter. And Henry, would you like a sandwich? Yes, that would be most wonderful. This one's got cucumber in it. But... <sighs> cucumber. Here comes Happy Henry. Oh, how much I... Love cucumber! Thank you so much, brother dear. <laughs> Something interesting, along comes a limousine. Giveaway. Do you know what I like most about your letter, Henry? Uh, no. 
It showed spirit. Where others might have been faint-hearted, you were brave. Where others might have told lies, you told the truth. Uh, Roy. I have a son, Henry. Yes, I know. We've uh, met. <laughs> and I would hope that my son would do for his father what you have done for yours. You what? I, I mean, uh, yes, definitely. <laughs> And do I understand that you're a Boodle Poodles fan too, eh? Well, I, uh... I love the show. So does Bill. Woof, woof. Woof, woof, woof. Right. Well, I probably ought to get back to school now. Yeah, of course, Henry. All those things you've got to learn so that one day you'll be clever enough to work for me. Just like your dad, eh? Will my dad... Get to keep his job? Well, yes. Tomorrow is another day, son. I'll take that as a yes, then. <laughs> Dad, there's a letter for you. Ready for a bit of me time? Ah, Henry. Ready for a bit of us time? Well, yes, but... No buts, Henry. We're going to spend some quality time together. Watching Boodle Poodle. Come on, Henry. Boodle Poodle with me. 